Jesse Selby, and I am auditioning for Aiden. How did you ever heard of knocking? I tried. For the last minute and a half. I thought maybe you had your headphones on. No, I'm just tired. Then shouldn't you be sleeping? I don't know. I'm thinking about taking up coffee drinking. No. No caffeine for you, Lucy Gray. <laughs> so how are you feeling? I'm okay. I think. I don't know. It's just, he was so close today, you know? We were in his little room and we stood over his bed. I mean, it's almost like mom and dad are bringing us back together, you know? It's all just <clears throat> too perfect. Blue. Now, Aiden, I know you're about to tell me not to get my hopes up and that I shouldn't get ahead of myself because I'll just wind up disappointed. Don't worry, I'm a big girl. I'll be fine. Okay, mind reader. If you're so smart, then, what else was I going to say? That you love me. <laughs> yeah, that too. Just be careful, Lucy, okay? I will, I will. How are you doing? I'm hungry. Really? Really? You're hungry. After everything that's happened today, you're hungry. What? Should I stop eating? Yes. You should take a vow of hunger and of poverty. And then you can donate your stuff to poor and impoverished me. Tell you what. I will take vows of hunger and poverty the day you take a vow of silence. <laughs> oh, well. Lucy can't talk. I guess you can't hold me to my promise. Mm. See you at the circus. See you on Jupiter. Night. Good night.